Well, in the kitchen today, Jess Thomas is making a popular dish. Here she is to make sweet cornbread. Hey all, it's Jess. In the South, we do love our cornbread and we sweeten up with some honey on top, but I'm gonna show you a version that we do in the North of sweet cornbread. Let's get started. First, we're gonna combine our dry ingredients. I've got a quarter cup of cornmeal. I've got three fourths of a cup of all purpose flour. I've got one third cup of sugar and half a tablespoon of baking powder as well as a quarter teaspoon of salt. And we just stir that around, combining it, and then we'll get our wet ingredients ready. I've got my cast iron skillet ready. I just put half a tablespoon of butter and a little bit of neutral oil. I'm gonna stick that in the oven to get it melted and hot. I'll take my egg and beat that just a little bit. Our butter has melted and we're just swirling that around for a crispy edge when it comes out of the oven. I've got half a cup and two tablespoons of whole milk and then to that I'm adding my egg. I'm also going to add my oil. This is three tablespoons of neutral oil. You can use canola and I've also melted butter. This is one and a half tablespoons of melted butter. Now we're gonna combine the wet with the dry, make a little well and pour it in. And we just stir to combine. I love serving this at brunch time. Sometimes muffins can be too cloyingly sweet. So even though this is sweet, it's not overly sweet, so it's perfect. Fresh out of the oven, look at the crisp golden edges. I would serve this with some butter and some compote. Here is a blueberry compote I made. You can also serve it with jams or just by itself. I love this cornbread because it's still got the crisp edges. It's soft and fluffy in the middle. You can find me on Instagram at Just Soul Food. If you make this, tag me and I'd love to see your creations because it's so delicious.